and there's one question I ask every evening which I should not be asking tonight. I always ask the panelists, are you ready to debate? But I don't need to ask Ashish Ketan and Sambit Patra at least because I know not only are they ready to debate, they are waiting to debate and they are prepared from both sides for the debate. I just want to set some ground rules because when I have two panelists on two sides as polarized, as upset and angry with each other as Ashish Ketan and Sanjay Sambit Patra presumably are or will be, I have, I have only two ground rules. Ashish, it's I'm good not. to see you. Just two ground rules. One is, please listen to the other side. Good to see you, Arnav. Good to see you as well. <laughs> if we are going to be so pleasant at the beginning of the program, people will think this is not the news. Sir. Now, the fact is, Ashish Ketan and Sambit Patra, my only request to you is, please listen to each other. <laughs> I will assure you that I will let both of you make your points to each other. But I believe if it's going to be a really good debate, so people have clarity on the issue of the Prime Minister's degree, you need to listen to him and he needs to listen to you. So as far as possible, don't speak over each other. Fantastic. Thank you. The second point I make a request, and this is Let to Sambit Patra up. and Ashish Ketan. Please don't get personal. Let's remain focused on the issue. Because when you get personal, you're not focused on the issue. The whole country is talking about whether there's any discrepancy in the Prime Minister's degree, right? Because of what the Aabadbi party has raised. You've responded. So, let's start. Are you both agreed, gentlemen? Do I have a gentleman's agreement on that? The whole country is asking, is it okay? I'm, I'm in complete agreement. Okay. I'm in complete agreement. Okay. So I'll start off. And here's the question which I have. And Sambit, listen to Ashuto, uh, uh, this, uh, Ashish Ketan's reply very closely. Ashish, listen, you don't need to make an ego issue of it. If you made a press conference, if you raised the issue earlier, you've been proven wrong, you can say, I'm wrong. You don't have to make an ego issue of it. And the reason I'm telling you this is because, you see, I'm looking at what Kejriwal claimed. Kejriwal claimed on 7th May, as well, and I'm looking at what's come out today. Kejriwal claimed on 2nd May, and you can note just two points, respond to them. He claimed on 2nd May that Narendra Modi's name was nowhere on the records of DU. Right? He said his name was nowhere in the records. Today, there are seven documents that have been put out which debunk the claim and set on record the fact that the Prime Minister's educational records are exactly what he made, put out in his 2014 election affidavit. Second point, Kejriwal said there is neither an enrollment form nor his name in the register. These are Kejriwal's exact words. And he went on to publicly claim that Modi has not obtained a degree. There are two degree certificates from Delhi University as well as Gujarat University that have set to rest the issue of the Prime Minister's educational degree certificates. So did you jump the gun without enough evidence at your disposal, without having examined the issue? Ashish Ketan, open the debate. When you finish, we'll get a response. The debate is open. Only request hear each other. Ashish, right. to you the opening round. Right. So I, I, I heard your long intervention at the start, your packages, and now the two questions that you have asked. And I hope the ground rules that you have set for me and Sambit will also apply to you, which is we'll debate this through logic and reason and not through anger and prejudice. So number one, you are talking about the six pages of documents released by Mr. Amit Shah and Arun Jaitley today. Who are Amit Shah and Arun Jaitley? Are the vice chancellor of the Delhi University? Are the registrar of Delhi University? Are the CPI of Delhi University? No, they are vested interests. They are vested parties. They are BJP. Where is Delhi University? You said the truth lies in records and documents. I completely agree with you. The truth lies in documents and records of Delhi University, not one which are released from 7 Ashoka Road from BJP headquarters. The truth lies in the following documents. Number one, the enrollment register. The register which carries the admission form with all enclosures. The register which carries the uh, records of who all appeared in different examinations between 75 and 79. The truth lies in the register of the convocation ceremony. There would be an order who got degree first, who got degree before Modi, who got degree after Modi. These are the registers and these are the records yeah, alone which can certify that the documents released by Mr. Amit Shah are genuine or not. Number one. <coughs> Number two. You know, Arnav, 
your channel i have been watching your channel from 2006 if i am not wrong when you were first launched you have always stood, stood for probity and integrity in public life why has the prime minister's office been dodging about rti's on his education qualification for 2 years why has delhi university been hiding facts and records for last 2 years why it took a cic order for the prime minister's office and for mr arun jetli to come out and do this press conference today and why even today the delhi university is defying the cic order we went for ins inspection we wanted to inspect all these records records but delhi university said sorry we could not show you all these records today it would have taken just one press conference and that press conference should have been by the vice chancellor of delhi university right. if not vice chancellor by the registrar of delhi university if not registrar by the deputy registrar of delhi university and he should have showed all these documents which no, i just but you see and would have said that look here are the records we show now you Narendra see Ramadha das modi now i'm very tempted i must say at this stage i Why must say happening? no no i must say at this stage at this say at this stage i must say that i am very tempted to respond to you because i have some facts which with with me which which would counter what you, you say should. but i will let sambit respond to you because let both of you square it off then i'll come in with some points only point that i'm making to you tonight is that i have all the documents agreed these are documents that have been given by the bjp right 1975 mark sheet narendra kumar damodar das modi 1976 mark sheet narendra damodar das modi the difference is modi is spelled with an i in 75 and with a y in 76 now come on ashish You don't tell me that these are two details. different people because one somebody Sir, typing please, it out is please, I and Y are mixed please. up. No, Let's no. not talk about these documents released by BJP. No. And no, I no, hope so, you have some questions from Mr. Sambit Patra as well. No, no, one sec, one sec. What is the second point? The second point. The second point which you made. The lock and key of Delhi the University. second point which you made. the second point which you made sorry i have i am succumbing to my temptation of responding to ashish ketan and then i sambit you can come in you see the second point which you made is okay so you are taking the side of mr patra uh, hello mr ashish ketan we are we'll ask questions to the bjp and to you equally please don't be touchy on that my point is i'm looking at the charge you made uh, you made a charge and uh, you said we have checked the records of yep. delhi university from 75 to 1980 and listen if i'm quoting you wrong say right now you are quoting me wrong but if i'm quoting you right then please tell me you're quoting me right and respond to my question ashish you said we checked the records of delhi university from 75 to 1980 at our level and have figured out i don't know what the meaning of figured out that there is no person with the name narendra damodar das modi was awarded any degree there was one person who did his graduation from 75 to 1978 but his name was narendra kumar mahavir prasad modi is a resident of alwar in rajasthan with october 19 1958 as a date of birth and hence this is a forgery now you are right and you are wrong there is one person called narendra kumar mahavir prasad modi correct. you are right he is a resident you of alwar let me complete right, let me complete i heard you i heard you ashish mr. rules mr. of Goswami. engagement mr goswam rules of engagement yeah you have you to listen yeah i 30 seconds that, you listen to I my point i can correct you if you are quoting me wrong well, this is what you've been quoted as saying you've not said this you're backtracking you on it that i can correct you if you are, if you have quoting no no but did you not say this is a crime you have not put out the full statement no but you said there is no narendra modi in you hence it is a half quote and half court is quoting you wrong no no one second you said i remember clearly Let you said you said there is only one narendra no, no, one modi second, and that sir. person one is second. from alwar in rajasthan did yes, you or did you not that. say that but we said something more as well tell me what did you we say we said something more as well sir what did you we say we said yes we said this but we said something more it is not a surmise you are turning it out to be a surmise it was not a conjecture come on we said that we have inspected all the record between 75 and 79 and we found only one narendra kumar modi and he was narendra mahavir prasad modi of alwar rajasthan and we found only his admission form sorry we didn't find his degree number 1 number 2 we also said that look we also inspected all the records we went to the control of examination we checked the register over there there was no narendra damodar das modi over there we went to the admission section there was no narendra damodar das modi there and we also went to the school of distance learning which at that point of time was used to be called as external education department and there was no narendra damodar das modi these all these facts combined together we said and on the top of it when registrar when the cpi of delhi university refused to show the now listen now listen to show a, a, now listen a, a, now, now listen now listen he said that now, now listen. Listen. all appears that there's a four no 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 listen to me listen to me ashish records. ashish i heard you now actually i'll let sambit come in because it's 10 minutes into the debate the other three panelists have not spoken they'll start complaining but i would please request you to understand you can equally be accused of shifting the goal post today your earlier contention 
was that there was only one Narendra Modi who studied at DU between 1975 and 1978. And that gentleman was from Alwar now, in Rajasthan. The fact like is, there was BFD such a person, well. but he was studying at a college called the Sriram College of Commerce. Now, here is a person called Narendra Damodar Das Modi who has studied the School of Correspondence courses, not the Sriram College of Commerce. So, they cannot be the same person. Now that you've been given proof that the Prime Minister did study there, you are claiming these documents are forged Sorry, in Sorry, sir. Take. Delhi University is so a custodian building of record of the colleges. your first one. Whether or not the college resides in the Delhi University campus or outside. School of Correspondence course is Delhi University. Delhi University is the custodian of all the documents. No, no. Are you, no, no what, Ashish, course, tell me. Ashish, tell me. Listen, well, listen. You know listen. I really Whoever need to get the others into the debate. I'll get Sambit into the debate. Yeah. Okay. It's not between you and me. Sambit, please uh, respond. Sambit, first of all, yes, first of all, the point that you need to understand is this. Why did you not respond to this for the past five days? A. By doing so, you have inadvertently given the AAP the oxygen they need to keep the issue alive. Right? And why, wh when the AAP was blaming you for forged degrees, why did you ni not nip the controversy in the bud? Even the CIC on April 29, 2016, if I'm not mistaken, directed the PMO to provide the specific number and year of the degrees. Why was no action taken? These are questions you need to answer, and it's your turn I to answer. respond to Ashish Ketan on the PM yes. degree proof debate. Sambit Patra, please. Ashish, your turn to listen. Yes, yes. Sambit. First, I'll answer Mr. Goswami's. That is your question that you have put, and thereafter, I would rebut back to what Ashish Ketan said. The question that you raise as to why for four or five days the Bharti Janata Party was quiet and why today it chose to respond, uh, and why not nip the, uh, at its, I mean, nip the flower at its bud stage itself, the answer is, it was a design by the Congress and its uh, ally party, I would say the Aam Admi Party, to see to it that the most important case of Augusta Westland gets diverted. <laughs> and it's, it happens in politics, you know, Mr. Goswami. In fact, your channel had picked up the okay. Augusta Westland case as uh, by none else. So naturally, this Congress party and the Aam Admi party and some Augusta Patrakars, in fact, they were in cahoots, what you rightly call as the Lachian, uh, Lachian Delhi cocktail circuit, you know. This cocktail circuit sat and they decided that, well, yes, how come the real culprits in the Augusta Westland case be exposed? Let's start this drama and let's attack Mr. Modi and this whole media would go gaga over it. We thought that, well, yes, if we fall into this trap, then naturally, the most corrupt people of this country respond would to exposed. the questions raised. Sambit Patra, came respond up, to the why, questions raised. And why you also we came heard up him? Today. You also heard him. Why we came up yeah. today? Yeah, crap. Yes, now the questions. Now the questions. Now the questions of Mr. Khetan. Look, Mr. Khetan, uh, how the goalpost has been shifted even today? Because today, immediately after the press conference of Mr. Amit Shah and Mr. Arun Jaitley, you had a press conference in which four questions were asked. Now you have changed the goalpost when we answered those four questions. What were the four questions? The four questions are the name and the degree and the mark sheet were different. Second question was 1977 mark sheet is there. How come the BA degree uh, is of 1978? Conveniently you skipped the 1978 degree. What is a topic? What is the subject called as entire political science? And how Narendra Damodar Das Modi has a Kumar in between? Now, let me first debunk you on these four charges. Okay, one second, Number one second. One, at this point, stop. One second, one second. I'm setting the rules. I'm setting the rules. One second, one second. Now on, now on, the way the debate will proceed is this. Because, uh, you know, when you make four points and he responds with four points, you will agree with me, both Sabha and Sunil will, because they are listening, that the viewer will lose strain of the four points and the responses. So, the rule at this point of time is this. We are presenting fact versus fact on the news hour tonight, this Monday evening. So, you present point number one and then stop. I want a response from the other side. Maybe a rebuttal if I allow it and then we continue. Point number one, Sambit, go on. Point number one, because after point number one, you'll stop and then Ashish will respond. Point, yeah, yes. point number one. Point number one, Ashutosh on, uh, I mean, Ashutosh on the pedestal of the press conference said today, you have the 1977 press conference, I mean, 1977 mark sheet, which he showed on his mobile phone. Yeah. And then he said that, look, the due certificate belongs to 1978. How yeah. is it possible? Yeah. My answer is, we have a 1978 mark sheet as well, which you showed right now, which yeah. I can show it yet again on the camera. Yeah. This is a 1978 mark sheet. There is so a 78 how mark sheet. Mr. Ashutosh and the Aam Admi people, people they skipped this 1978 mark sheet which was released by the party which was in public possession okay so is this not a rhetoric deliberate concealment of facts is the charge tonight one second sambit i got your point 
We need to cover a lot of ground. The direct charge you make at Ashish Ketan's party is deliberate concealment of facts. And in fact, Hindi mein mein kehta hoon jo Ashutosh ne kaha tha. Kyunki wo pehle television mein Hindi ke anchor reh chuke hai. Wo Hindi mein kabhi 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 aise shabd, pata nahi Ashish, Ashutosh ne kaha tha press conference mein. Unho ne kaha, nakal ke liye bhi akal ki zarurat hai. One even needs brains to copy. This was the kind of language used at the press conference. Now, you said, Ashish, mark sheet 77, degree 78. Let me respond now. No, no, one second, one second. Let me respond. Uh, no, no, one I heard that. You Let heard it? Respond. No, can I ask you a question? You lose the train of thought. Okay, continue. Continue, yes, continue, continue, continue. Yes, no, let me Go respond. on with your rebuttal, yeah. Okay, now, yeah, uh, for the viewer's sake, for the viewer's sake, for the viewer's sake, and I will respond in also both chaste Hindi and chaste English. I'll try. Now, number one, it will be a complete monstrosity to allege that certain facts so-called facts have been just put out by BJP stalwarts Amit Shah and Arun Jaitley in a press conference and documents were circulated and distributed to the entire press and 60 minutes later when Aam Aadmi does a press conference they by not talking about certain documents which were circulated in the press conference just held will be concealing facts you call it concealment but there is a 78 really mark sheet that now concealment so what is that when you have documents so what is that the entire press has documents you are now saying that we are concealing anything you are putting out certain facts so and we are that? responding to show? you we are concealing So you anything? did not do your homework Who properly sir today? You should have done it's your homework properly which has been concealing Why did you, why did you jump now. to hold Let a press complain. conference when you did Let not see the documents completely? Mean. That means Let you me wanted complain. to buy some political brownie mean. points that's it I didn't You have nothing No sir Okay Samir one second Let him complete this point 30 seconds Ashish complete Ashish complete I am losing the debate that you have resorted to shouting and speaking over let me complete. I didn't intervene at all. Don't lose the debate. I am saying that this is not concealment. It will be a monstrosity. It will be a complete monstrosity and twisting of logic to say that we have concealed anything. Who has concealing? Who has been concealing? Prime Minister's office faced several RTIs. I don't the last the the logic, sir. Ashish. Arnav, you would say that as Prime Minister, as the, as the holder of the topmost office of this country, he would voluntarily disclose his documents Ashish. pertaining to his education. Ashish, Ashish, you'll have Why to hear me. Why somebody have to resort to RTIs? Okay, Ashish. To Ashish, know about the BJP Ashish, will you hear me? Ashish, will you hear me now? What's why did, Ashish why now did count? the Delhi know? No, Ashish, but losing the track or no? Point number one. Okay, complete. rebuttal allowed. Ashish, to, Ashish, Ashish, point Ashish, on this Resolve, point, on this point, on this point, I'm allowing a rebuttal. On this you point, I'm allowing a rebuttal. I'm allowing a rebuttal. I'm allowing a rebuttal. Ashish, listen, take the rebuttal. Take the rebuttal, okay? I'm allowing a rebuttal. Now listen, Samit, make it sharp. And then I'll respond. Because I have some facts to present here. Yeah, Samit. Yes. 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 Pa yep. Just a second, Ashish, Ashish, when you say that this is not concealing the facts, then I would say this is not doing your homeworks. Because when you had all the pre mark sheets in front of you, all the degrees in front of homework? you, which were released by the party president, you conveniently chose not to show the 1978 mark sheet and you misled the Put public. By the party the second point, just a second, sir. The second point, the second point is that you said there's nothing called as entire political science as a subject. Here I present the letter of the vice chancellor of Gujarat University who defined finds what this entire political science is. He says that when the examiner attends for all the eight subjects the in same political science who is without wanted, taking any subordinate subject, that is called as the entire political science. Sir, now you would say the vice chancellor is also not important. Now you will say no, we would not hear to anyone. That's not the answer. I have authenticated documents I heard with you. me, Let with me, me respond. where the vice chancellor has given a definition to the entire political science. Ashutosh's second point was there is nothing Let called as respond. entire political science. Now will you apologize over here on the news hour for oh. misleading the people of this country, sir? Sure, sure. Point sure. Now let me respond. I took your question. Let me respond. Number one, who has been putting out all this information in piecemeal manner? It's a BJP. Who has been planting stories in the newspapers? It's a BJP. Who planted this story five, years, five days ago? A degree appeared in the newspaper Times of India quoting sources the Prime Minister's office that there will be an accidental loss. That is our degree, the Baba. We the didn't steal a degree and bring. Destroyed. It's the BJP. It's our own degree. Who we can bring it anywhere let, where me wish to. let me complete. Let me complete. Planted let me the complete. story. Let me my complete. own degree. Why would Let I plant complete. it anywhere? Don't, 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 don't get, don't, don't get scared. Let me. No, complete. no, no. You are not answering don't the specific, Mr. Goswami. Who the rules of engagement are only in specifics. Answer. It is the BJP. You cannot subterfuge why, the topic. Why all these plants? What why planted? Are you planting stories? What planted? Yeah. Why would I plant Today, my own? Why planted. would I plant my own degree anywhere? What do you mean planted? Let me complete. 
you know you are you answer whether no entire political by science is a subject or not a subject not that's all complete. be specific you are showing that you are indeed okay. nervous be, be you inside no sir facts. you are not being you incisive are accused you are not being specific stories. but fact everybody is, knows that please, last 10 days mr goswami's rule of engagement was we have to be specific the specific point number two is entire political science why do you need to plant not a subject please answer is this a subject or it is not a subject Let rest and everything else does not matter you have been you only repeating point yourself point number 2 entire repeating science is a subject you are not a subject yes or no which was set out by mr yes or no okay one second yes sambit patra no. now listen really sambit patra now listen both of now gentlemen gentlemen watch it can i intervene please thank you thank you very much now the issue here is this some viewers say What are the facts that Mr. you have at your disposal? One point. second, I want Sabha and I want I want Sabha and Sunil Alag to come in. They both been listening to this debate, and all of us have. First of all, I appreciate you must be taking quite an effort tonight, Ashish Kethan and Sambit Patra, to pull back when I say you do, because this appears to be more discipline I've had on the program than maybe in the last one year. So first of all, thank you for that. Now the point is this, Sabha. I'm going to put some facts out. Every fact but, that I put out, but you need to, but you need to also note here that he did break the ground rule. Yeah, you're breaking the ground rules a bit, both of you, but that's all right. Now listen to me, gentlemen. That's all right. I mean, this is not a, no, this no. is not a, this. What you are not in kindergarten that I can't let you debate each other. That's all right. You will be swayed by the by the debate. You really cooperated. Uh -huh. Thank you very much. But here is my he, point tonight. Now, Sabha, listen. Now, now Sabha, 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 and Sunil Alag. One second. Opening remarks on this. Who's winning this one? Sunil Alag and Sabha, you both have your, you know. But the fact is, Sabha, even though you know you very often support the Aam Aadmi Party, you realize on this one, when you go into the issue in detail, each mark sheet over the years is matching. And a simple point to Ashish on a side, you say, Ashutosh says, why is the mark sheet dated 78 and the degree dated 79? Please understand. I put it on record the timeline according to the official documents in our possession, so that it is established that yes, the prime minister's mark sheets were 78, the degree was 79, not because some degree was being faked, but because in 1978 he was clearing some papers for which he was given an ER. All of us studied in any university know ER means you fail a subject in that year, so you are given one more chance to pass it. It's called an essential repeat. And if you go through the facts now, the facts are like this: Sabha in the first year, Narendra Modi passes all his subjects and his marks amount to 165 on 400, right? 75. 76 he scores 121 on 400 he passes political science and his mark sheet I'm pardon me I'm just make a small point here but no no watch I'm again you know you who's disturbing my strain of thought I here I need to stop you for no 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 you moment. can't you left to listen one now moment. listen no. now listen one moment one now moment now listen ashish i will not take more than one moment <coughs> i will not take more than one moment ashish just when i'm I presenting the facts which would be uncomfortable to you to stop me that's not right just when i'm presenting the facts which may not be right for you you stop me documents released by bjp headquarters yeah so these are documents okay fine i got your caveat listen listen to me listen to me listen to me now the second is second is second is therefore the responsibility of delhi university if the documents are fake to come out and say the documents are fake now listen these are not the document Hey, Very listen, Ashish. Ashish, you're breaking the ground rules by your own level. The you second year, in second year, in second year, as the basis, the surmise of this debate. Hello, Ashish. Listen, it has to be mentioned. Here. Ashish, listen. I, I, I have, I've had the opportunity. Oh my God, what happened? I've had the good fortune the to go to Delhi rules. University, and anybody who goes to any university knows if you fail a subject in one year, you get one more chance. Second year, he scores 121 of 400. He passes political science. His mark sheet shows. Generic, his mark sheet shows an ER, which we believe in an essential repeat in English. Hindi and history. There is a B.A. degree that's a generality. In English, Hindi and history. In the third year. In the third year. There is something called mark sheet for generality. In the third year. But you cannot make specific charges. No, one second, yeah. Ashish, Ashish, listen, na. In the oh. third year, in the third year, he scores 473 on 1200. One second, Ashish, now listen to me. In the third year, he scores 473 on 1200. Again, his mark sheet shows an ER, which is an essential repeat in history. And a bona fide surmise of a debate. Now, in the year 1978, as per these documents which the BJP has released. In the year 1978, in the year 1978, he takes supplementary. In the year 1978, he takes supplementary in history and gets a final score of 489 out of 1200. Now, according to his Delhi University degree certificate, dated 23rd of March 1979, according to yes, Ashish, listen. Yeah, listen, Ashish, listen. According to his Delhi University degree certificate, dated 23rd March 1979. 
he qualifies for the degree bachelor of arts where he is conferred the ba degree at a convocation held in 1979 where he is declared to have passed in division 3rd that's the point now now listen to me the point is that there are seven or eight documents now sabha I, I, you you believe that seven or eight all of these documents presented where the numbers that's match the each other of your debate are bhai the numbers the match each other the, the subjects match each other really? the years no, match each other full person in the country who has the ib reporting to him who has cbi reporting come to on, him come on that was not your initial argument sabha sabha okay sabha no, 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 okay okay sabha sabha and sunil ala please sabha sabha and sunil ala please sabha is coming in with a chance that i can plan ashish ashish you have to stop talking now seven or eight documents okay what say sabha sabha and sunil ala please debate is open yeah point ashish stop talking Stop no. talking for half an hour. No. You've spoken for half an hour. You've spoken. Can I, Ashish, allow us. me to say? Okay, yes, please, please, please allow me. Sunil and Sabha. Sunil first, and then Sabha. Yeah. I don't have to take. I don't have to take your permission, Mr. Sunil Alag. Okay, Ashish. Ashish, no, Ashish, no, Ashish, 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 I said nothing I personal tonight. Yeah. That's all you only okay. likes to hear his own voice. Okay, nothing personal. Let's debate. Let's debate. We want to debate this. We want to debate this. So we listen to each other. Let's debate this. I'm not getting a Sunil chance. Sunil Alag and then Sabha. Yeah, Sunil and Sabha. They also want to debate. Yeah, Sunil okay, first, I, then Sabha. Can I say something? Okay, Sabha goes okay. first. Go on. Okay, first of all, uh, Ashish, uh, you know this thing about uh, documents. I, I, I do, I do think that false uh, documents is a very important thing. False mark sheets. It was why Vyapam was all about fake. Engineered mark sheets. It's a very serious issue. We should grapple with it. But you can't. You uh, all parties have released documents. AAP has also released documents in the past. I just have one. It's a slightly lighter thing that if there was going to be forgery, then you know these are such shockingly bad marks. And it also shows that the prime minister oh. became a graduate at the age of 28, 29. I remember Sambit Patra. Going on and on about certain students. Is that the issue, Sabha? No, no, Sabha. Is that the issue? No, no. Is that the issue? No, no. It's not lighter. Is that the issue? You're digressing from the issue. Sabha is responding. Sabha is responding. One second. No. One second. One second. Sabha is responding. 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 Really bad, bad marks. Number one, and when you said no, I also age, have... he became a graduate. Remember, he comes from just a second. Sabha, let me complete for ten seconds. I would not interrupt. They are. I promise. Number one, let me remind you of the fact that he was yeah. from a very poor family, a chai wala. His mother used to work at others places. Can the elitist Lutians Jones? I Jones agree. No, no, Sabha, let him complete. Yes, I agree. Sabha, listen, let me complete. How that is let him complete. Our let him complete. Ordinary man travels, travels, uh, travels to the capital of this country to complete his graduation. Can we be that kind? Sabha is speaking. Yeah, it is you i am so fucking excited can yeah. you be so kind and secondly no, I second is very kind for the one second sunil you bhai no bad no no marks. bad marks let me tell sabha 10 seconds bad marks i think i think at this stage i think at this stage i think at this stage of emergency look those were the days of emergency arna 77 76 arna can could not can sabha and i come in without examination i think i think okay okay one second have been for mr modi to prepare for exam No, I'm not being able How to finish. We don't. No, I think, I think, I think. Now, Sabha, listen. Sabha, one second, listen. Listen, Sabha. Are we to say tonight? One second. One second. Sunil Alag and Sabha, and I want to say something. Sambit, you made your point. Let's not repeat ourselves. The point I'm making tonight. I'm sorry, Sabha. I'll have to say this to you as clearly as I can. I'm sorry, Sunil. Sunil, one second. Sunil. Sabha and me debate. No, it's all. Sunil, Sabha and Sunil will debate. Just one minute. Let them come into the debate. First of all, first of all. Sabha and me speak. First of all, first of all, Sabha. Without interruption. You know, you know, you know. I, 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 I. The the simple point is that there are discrepancies in the name of the big smoking gun. that was being clung on to to prove a charge as serious as the yes. prime minister of india forging his educational qualifications so while you are saying that i am trying to make this in a lighter vein the fact of the matter is please don't don't shift the goal post to what marks prime minister modi got the issue so far was whether he forged the paper the issue was whether he's so, forged his no no one second one second sabal the issue I is whether the agree. papers are forged now that they come out and say no no we've got all these seven papers to prove they are not forged you're saying oh but you know what he didn't get good enough marks i mean is that the argument 
Did the Prime Minister get a second division or third division? I think no, we are trivializing the debate. I'm Tri saying no. let there be. No, no, I, no, 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 no. So let me reply. No, no, no. Let no, me no, reply. No, that's, I'm, that's not, not. I'm not saying no, no. that. No, no, that's I'm not saying, an issue. I'm saying if there is still an allegation of forgery, let's let's you know every uh, where is no no what Saba Saba listen Saba listen today today if you or I listen no no Saba Saba listen if today you or I you or I are told what degree did you get where did you pass your class 12 or class 10 examinations okay where did you do a postgraduate degree or not and you say well you know what I did and somebody says oh but you know in Saba's second year degree instead of SABA somebody wrote SAB double A or SABAH right and then I turn around and say, you forger, you forged your degree. And then I said, no, no, but I didn't forge my degree. But they said, but you know what? You may not have forged your degree, but I think, don't think you got good marks. That's not a qualification what marks you got. You can shift, keep shifting the goalposts. Oh, you didn't get good marks. Oh, but the name is not spelled exactly right, but the alphabets don't match. I mean, are, is that going to be the issue in this country? Uh, three days into the Augusta issue, and you know, and I know how big Augusta was. No, it's not. Why don't no, no, Why don't you ask? No, why don't not. you ask, for example, why no. three days when Augusta was breaking, the biggest story of corruption opens up a defense scam of unbelievable proportions? Is the only issue the Ahmadmi Party picks up with such enthusiasm? That of whether what the Prime Minister's degree was, and now you're saying, well, you know, let's talk about what marks he got. I think Sabha, let that's not correct. correct. Let me correct you, Mr. Goswami. What, what are you correcting me for, Ashish? That should not get, that should not go unchallenged. Let me, let me correct that, Can Mr. I, Goswami. No, did you not raise this in the context of Augusta? Of Augusta Westland. We have That's been saying that what no, this government has been doing for the last two years. Should I reply? Italian court has committed the bribe deal. No, 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 one second. No, no, Ashish, listen. In this country. Ashish, what listen. What has the CBD doing? Not to what hasn't the CBD doing? Otherwise no, let me. Let you chance. listen, Mr. Goswami. You, have to you listen, them Mr. Off. Goswami. You, have, you have been biased in this debate. Otherwise, otherwise Sabha. One second, one second. Sunil, one second. We have done a massive value of Mr. Westland on Saturday. One second, one second, Mr. Goswami. One second, Mr. Is Mr. it an issue what marks the Prime Minister got now, Ashish? Are you telling me what marks he got is the issue? But that was never the issue. On Saturday, Can you keep quiet for what even five minutes? What are you doing while leave? And let Sabha and Did you talk. hear what Arvind said on Augusta Westland? Oh God, yeah. Listen, you hear what listen, Arvind Ashish. Said on Augusta Westland? Listen, Ashish. Now you cannot do Ashish, back. listen. You cannot show your prejudice. Ashish, listen. You have not asked one hard Ashish, question yeah, of Sambit Patra. You Ashish. have only positioned this debate in a way Ashish that it suits BJP. Ashish, listen. It suits most Mr. Modi. Fine. Now, now Sunil is responding to you. you. Now that's all right. That's all. You can get back. Now, now, Sunil is responding to you. We have not made a big issue. Okay, fine. Fine. One second. One second. Ashish, yes. Okay, okay, gentlemen. No, 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 no. Before, before Ashish Ketan and Sambit Patra take off again. Before Ashish Ketan and Sambit Patra take off again, I want Sunil Alak to come in. And gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, you'll agree with me. You'll agree with me. He's been waiting 45 minutes. He hasn't said a word. Sunil Alak. Yeah, I know. And not a word. I mean, it's look, as far as I'm concerned, this is the most non-issue thing that our Aadmi party has taken up. It's like Trump uh, claiming that Obama is a Muslim, he is not an American and it is then disproved at the end of it where he had to go and prove that his birth certificate and everything else and he got through. This is so irrelevant today as far as he is concerned whether you spell M-O-D-Y. I was spelled as S-H-U-N-I-L in Calcutta because Sunil was pronounced as Shunil. It was corrected later. Look, this is totally irrelevant. And the fact that Sabha was raising, which nobody allowed, was that, look, if Mr. Modi wanted to fudge any records, why would he say he has failed? Why would he come out with such accurate things of saying, look, I've had to reappear. He has been from a very poor family, a very honest individual. And as far as Mr. Jetley is concerned, he is a Supreme Court lawyer. He is not going to come out and say these documents are right. And Aam Admi has always claimed that the media has been one, the jury, the judge and everything else. Okay, okay, Ashish, after exactly he finishes, please. Way. Ashish, after Let he finishes. the facts come out. As far as we are concerned, this is the most irrelevant issue as far as I am concerned for the nation to be debating. It is not relevant. I mean, at all. Today, we've got rapes going on. We need to look at the economy. The and Aam Admi, after two and a half years, that's all they come up with. Then why did Amit the issue and which finance is a the country in the middle of the it budget? It shows how bankrupt the they are or what they are doing in Delhi. If this is an irrelevant issue, 
why the two most powerful people in yeah. BJP after Mr. Modi hold a press conference? Can I come it's, in? Why did it's the an irrelevant because he has to respond to an irrelevant why issue raised by you. Hold a press conference? You have raised but an irrelevant issue. issue. Okay, Sunil, Who somebody will respond to that. Ah. Sambit will respond, will respond to that. Respond to you. Ashish, somebody has to respond to you. Not listen, by the finance minister. Listen, I am following on, yeah. the ground and holding up you, M O D Y, M O D I. All that rubbish is going on. It's crazy, absolutely crazy. Okay, Sambit is absolutely crazy. Sambit is responding. Then Sabha comes I back to the debate. I have a question to ask from the Aam Aadmi Party. No, no. I want to ask a question to the Aam Aadmi Party. Allow me one question. This is a very pertinent question that Aam Aadmi Party and Mr. Kejriwal should answer. No, I want to ask the RTI. No, no, no. Some, Ashish, Ashish, yeah, you ask your questions one to each other after answering each other's, please. No, no, you will ask your question. One second, one second. Sambit, now listen. Not both of you together. Sambit, please stop. Please stop. Both of you stop. One second. You want to ask questions of each other? Take it through me. No, no, you want to ask questions of each other? My only request is take it through me. Ashish, listen, it's only fair. You want to ask questions of each other? Please do. Please do. But I request you take it through me. So I say, okay. Since Ashish said, I also have a question to yes. ask. Don't ask a question while he's asking his. You ask a question, we answer quickly, then you can ask a counter question, but please take it through me. Sambit, now go on. Go on, please. Viewers, please judge tonight I who's can, winning the PM degree proof debate. Sambit's I, I first question to you Ashish. Can I Thank you. One question. Okay, fine. You will. You will. One second. Uh, uh, please, Sambit, look, I'm following the rules. Yeah, in the I'm in the following the rules. But the rules. Ashish, you're breaking the rules. Ask a question. Let me complete in 10 seconds. You don't hold a press conference. Ashish, please don't break the rules. Drought. Please don't, don't break the rules. Be a good boy. No, I'm on time you don't hold now. a press conference. Be a good boy. Ash Ash Ashish, in Ashish, this is you not the way. Be a good boy. Don't be like Ashish. Foreign policy, which is in complete disarray. Yes. Please, please. Why do you, you hold a press conference? Let me uh, ask something. Mr. You think Mr. Mr. Okay, no, no. Sambit, you might as well respond to that. Listen, Sambit, we're wasting time. We're wasting time. The question put to you tonight is and respond. Respond. Respond here, please. From Augusta Westland. Fine. The question is understood now, please. Ashish Ketan, listen, if somebody has a contrarian position to yours, they're not necessarily a bad person. They're not necessarily biased or prejudiced. You also need to have an open mind on that. You are asking a question. The reason why I asked that question is because I wonder whether it was a coincidence no. that you began picking this issue on the 28th of April, just three days after the Augusta story began to snowball. And I asked tonight, who benefits the most from that? Agastya is snowballing and you pick this issue, who benefits the most from that? Everyone knows that. Does the Congress benefit from that? Can I ask my question now? Who shook the foundations of the Congress government? Can I ask my question now? Who shook the foundations of the Congress government in 12 and 13? Who resigned on the issue of... Which is more recent for me to ask the question? Who shook the foundation? It's the Aam Aadmi Party. Who broke the story? That is not more important. Now on the degree now, I want to ask a question to Arvind Kejriwal directly through your channel. Please allow me. I will not interrupt Mr. Khaitan. Mr. Khaitan, let's behave. Then disclose full facts. Put the whole context okay. out in okay. public domain. No, 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 you created don't, the whole universe. It's selective. Okay. No, Again, you're not listening to each other. Thanks for that. Now listen to my question. Don't contextualize this debate. Uh, Augusta West Land should go on. Yes, Augusta yes, West yes. You created the whole universe, Baba. Listen to me now. We answer. should be taking action on Augusta West Land. Okay, okay, Ashish. Answer, Ashish. answer, answer why Mr. Arvind Kejriwal is not exposing, not coming out with the fact that he does not have an All India ranking in IIT. Will Mr. Arvind Kejriwal Kejriwal also Take come out and say Sonia what is his Don't all India Sonia ranking Sonia in IIT because through an RTI, Mr. Khetan, please Sonia behave yourself. Sonia this is not the way. Mr. Khetan, this is not the way, sir. Please, will you please hear others? Ashish, Ashish, Just because you have been cornered, that does not mean you will not allow Ashish, others to speak. Ashish, okay, one second, please. One second, one second. One second. Sir, sir, one second. No, no, one second. Sambit, Sambit, first of all, both of you. Gentlemen, please, please, please come down, gentlemen. Can I, can I request the two spokespersons of the two parties to please let me intervene. I mean, don't let this go out of hand. No, one second, Sambit, rule is this. Please listen to me. No, this, you know, one I, second. I was waiting for my No turn, complaining Mr. about Rosh other panelists, please, on the program. Let me handle well. this. One second, Sambit Patra, listen. You first I'm answer. I'm following all the Sambit Patra, Patra, Mr. Patra, Dr. Patra, calm down. Take a deep breath. It's okay. Yes, drink that glass of water. I'm calm. Now, now, now relax, 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 relax. Are Sambit, listen. Is not for, uh, I mean, uh, Sambit, listen, listen, yes, listen, tell, listen, tell. listen, listen. You come and all. I think you've been missing Ashish Ketan on television and likewise tonight. So I'm glad you're squaring off on the news out tonight. My question is, Sambit, listen. You got to respond to Ashish's question and then ask your question. Ashish asks you a question, and his question is, if this is a non-issue, why did two powerful BJP leaders do a press conference at the start of a week? First, give a crisp reply to that, then you ask a counter yes. question. Now, Ashish, when he responds to your question, don't jump in again because let the debate continue. Sambit, respond to that first and then go in with your counter question. Yes. Yeah. Number one to Ashish's spe specific question as to why two great leaders of the party responded to Mr. Arvind Kejriwal's accusations.
because he is not just the, Mr. Modi is not just the Prime Minister of Bharatiya Janata Party. He is the Prime Minister of the country. And when you hurl unfounded, misleading accusation on the Prime Minister of the country, naturally you are demeaning the name of India as such. And we are one of the powerful, biggest Sabha, democratic the, party of this country. I want Sabha's take on that. I want Sabha's take on that before. No, 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 no. Before, 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 before Ashish responded. No, no. Is before you go to your question, Sabha, you buy that. Mr. Sabha, you buy that. Please you think the BJP did the right thing or the wrong thing by doing? The press why conference do, why today. do you want that I should not be asking Mr. Ali? Are you will ask him. Relax. But why, no, why, why do you I want not? A mistake? Yes. Sub, I, sub, 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 no, no, I don't exposed. want anything. I Can want someone to ask you what you say. As a, as a public Sabha. relations, I think the BJP. Can I? Uh, yeah, go on, Sabha. Can I, I? I think the BJP has walked into a trap in, uh, set by our Admi Party why because exactly so much this, noise has been made about this. Sabha I think they could have made a press should release. Should not a democratic party not have respond to Can when abuses are heard need, at the prime minister? Should we not respond with facts? This no, is what walked, we did. Uh, For you, he may not be the prime minister because you are. No, no, I'll tell you. None you of you love the Prime trap. Minister. You and Ashish Khetan don't like the Prime Minister. But for us, he is the he is the pride of the country. So naturally, when you accuse us of being the pride of this country, I'm we talking will about a perception We will exercise. come with facts. We will come with strong that's facts. We will show his degree to the Some world. Have this a is rational not just debate. the Aam Aadmi Party. Have a rational These debate. degrees are to the world. If there was an iota of suspicion in debate. any person in this world, oh my then God, today our national please president don't showed them. Look, have these debate. are the degrees. These are the degrees. We are not running away. But my question is, Sabha, you follow it news very precisely. No, Sabha, debate. you know what has happened recently. An RTI report was submitted as far as Arvind Kejriwal's degrees are concerned. Arvind was asked whether how did he find his way to iit the iit reports by saying that there is no all india ranking of arvind k jival will mr arvind k jival oh. come back and answer where what, what? is his all india ranking because there was a 2000 come on what's the relevance of that, that some Sambay? people some people come on this is relevant come on come on come on you're you not picking red herrings here what i'm saying illegal quota system what is it true that arvind k jival also through navin jindal got Sambay? an admission into iit through illegal quota system i am reading from newspaper reports i may be wrong i may be right but i'm asking this question to arvind k jival this is a democratic country he asked you question to the prime minister no 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 okay ashish ashish and sabha ask a question to arvind k jival don't just accuse Register an FIR against Arvind Kejriwal. I dare don't you just accuse. FIR against Arvind Kejriwal. Don't just accuse. You are, running a you are the abusing and accusing party, party of the country. AAP. Register an FIR. Abusing and accusing party of the country. I am showing you the truth. You Look at the RTI the report. What does the RTI the report says? AIR, All India ranking not available. Why is the All India ranking of Mr. Arvind Kejriwal not available? Because of Naveen Jindal, he got admission into IIT. That is the reason. No, no, I don't understand. What are you saying? You're saying what you is... You prove charges, sir. You Very prove good. the no charges. charges. No, viewers, at this point, I'm taking a break. One second. Ashish, 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 Ketan, Ashish, Ketan, Ashish, Ketan, Ashish, Ketan. One second, one second, one second, one second, one second, one second. Acha, one minute. Acha, one minute. Ashish, Ashish, listen. One point here. One point here. But Arna, you one point. Can I? Can I? Acha, do I have your one second, gentlemen? One second. One second. Yes, one not Sonia Gandhi. You are the party which were in coalition with the Congress for power. Mr. Goswami, remind them. They were in coalition with the Congress for power. I am asking a question tonight. I am asking a question tonight. I, I am asking a question tonight. I am asking a question tonight, and I have a, I have a limitation. I have a limitation. I have a limitation. I want to share at this point of time, gentlemen. One minute, please. Wait, one minute. Yeah. Come on. It's a fascinating debate. But I have to, I don't want to, but I have to take a short commercial break. Now, gentlemen, I'm asking you, will you indulge me? I take a short commercial break and come back. Because outside in my newsroom, the phones are ringing tonight. People are calling and I'm not opening the phone lines, but people have views on what's being discussed between Sambit Patra, Ajish Ketan, and Saba and Sunil Alag. So I take a small break. And I hope you'll stay with me when I come back. Just a small, small break. Then we do another 10 minutes of the debate on popular demand. This debate is being extended. The couple of questions are, is the worst accusation against Narendra Modi that he was not observant enough of checking the way his name was spelled? Does that amount to fraud? And why does Sambit Patra suddenly raise questions about what Arvind Kejriwal's IIT joint entrance exam ranking was? What's the relevance of that? Sambit Patra, questions on both sides. The debate continues. Short break. Back in a few minutes. Don't go away. Don't go away.
Well, debate continues. Debate continues. We go straight to the debate. Viewers, tell us who do you think is winning the debate, the Ahmad B party or the BJP? <coughs> Excuse me. This is the AAP. <coughs> Excuse me. AAP BJP tonight, uh, debate tonight between Sambit Patra, Ashish Ketan with uh, Sunil Alag in as a not so neutral observer and Sabha is going to come back to the debate. Now, facts which Ashish Ketan does not like but which cannot be disregarded nevertheless. A uh, couple of points. Ashutosh says in his press conference earlier today, the Prime Minister's mark sheet is dated 1978 while the year of the degree is 1979. If you read from the University of De Delhi degree present certificate in our possession, it says that the University of Degree Bachelor of Arts 1978, this is to certify Given that the Narendra, Narendra Damodar Das Modi has been examined in 1978, found qualified for the degree of Bachelor of Arts, admitted to the said degree at the convocation held in 1979. So basically, Narendra Modi gave his BA final papers in 1978 after giving supplementary papers in some got his de degree at the convocation in 1979 as the paper says very squarely. I mean, what's the confusion there? And second point is, the mark sheets, uh, the name of the mark sheet is Narendra Confusion Kumar Damodar. Can, can I take this can question? I, before anyone else says anything. Okay, Sunil wants to say something. Yeah, Sunil. No, no, no. Sunil, no. come on. Yeah, can what? I take the question? Arnab, I just want to come me, in right? at one no, no. point. The okay, question is Sunil, one second. Very quickly. Very, very quickly. No, no, one second. One second. Arnab, very quickly I want to say, you know, Mr. Modi gave an interview to Rajiv Shukla many years ago, yeah. saying I've passed my school. I was then asked by various people to appear by, by correspondence and do my arts and BA and I did it and I'm an unpar. He was very honest and he was very upfront about whatever it was there that interview is still being screened. It's yeah. about time we took that. When One second. The second question was why did Jetli and everybody come in and answer? Look, in India if you don't answer something like this, everybody treats it as you're guilty. You have to come out and answer. It's as simple as that. Keeping quiet on issues like this doesn't doesn't help anybody in India. Then why, so why, please why, try and understand. Why, where were they for the last two years? Honest. For the last two years, there have been not one but multiple RTIs. I heard you, Mr. Allah. Can I reply? My question Mr. is, Mr. Allah, can I respond to that? Okay, Sunil. Sunil is responding. Sunil is responding. 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 Why was the in Delhi University blocking this information all along? No, no. What is? No, no. You can respond as much as you want, Mr. Goswami. Why would you stop? I'm happy. Why did you not, Mr. Roy? Why did you respond for the last few years? No, no, no. Planted. No, no. Why Mr. Roy did not respond for the last few years? If he had to force the documents today, he would have forced the documents last few years ago also. Why, why, well, why last few years you have been blocking this is common sense back. about Agreed. his education Absolutely qualification. Agreed. Sir, the the visit was that interview of 16 years ago, what do you Mr. Mean? Modi, what do we, Mr. What do we, Modi what gave an interview to this? Rajiv Sukla now of the Congress Party. Manner. He was a journalist then, 16 years ago. And he gave the chronology of his studies hey, then, way back. 16 years ago, he said that this was the time when I came to Delhi. This is the I did. Everything was disclosed 16 years ago. Sunni, I have the English translation of the Rubaru show. One second, I have the English translation of the Rubaru show. Disclosed? You call, you call this disclosure? One second. This is not disclosure. One second. This is listen, planting of stories uh, Ashish, in piecemeal panel. Ashish, listen. In, in a way which is planting Ashish, of story. Ashish, 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 16 is years ago is planting of a story. The fact that he failed I, was not a disclosure. I want to make this one more. That story already exists in the ground. How can you plant a story? The only not a disclosure. The only entity which can certify and validate this information is a disclosure right now. Through production of authentic records. And that is Delhi Okay, tell me one thing. Can can you can you tell me one thing? Listen, Ashish. Ashish. Ashish, listen. Okay, okay, disclosure. okay. Common sensical question. Can I ask a common sensical question? By the way. Oh, let's. Oh, oh come on. Let's do a debate on Narvin Kejriwal's record. A common sensical question to Ahmad. Question is what? Uh, uh, one second. I will show you. Sambit Patra and Ashish Keta. Sambit Patra and Ashish Keta. If you want to be television anchors, please tell me. Otherwise, let me anchor the show, please. One second. If you're both going to be television anchors, no, no, no. But you said that you're going to ask a common sensical question. Sambit Patra, listen. Sambit, listen. Sambit, how can you ask a common sensical question to Ahmad? Okay, Sambit. Sambit, I said no personal comments today on the program, and I stick with that. One has to have. One has to have that virtue to take. Why is stretching no. the argument now, Sambit? Please stop here. Yeah. Whether they have that virtue or not. Okay, now please stop for a moment. Huh? One second. Thank you very much. One second. Please, Sambit. The question is, now what were you trained to be? I thought you were trained to be a medical specialist. You're behaving like a TV anchor. Now one second, listen to me. Question is, the charge, the Prime Minister Narendra Modi in 2001, <laughs> before he became Chief Minister, thank God, Sabha is smiling here. The pri pri Prime Minister Narendra Modi, when he was simply a BJP secretary, I think, before he became Chief Minister in 2001, in the good old days when Rajiv Shukla was not a politician, 
but he was a journalist he did an interview show called rubaru and the full interview the translation is this rubaru in rubaru rajiv shukla asked narendra modi you know uh, right. tell me about your educational qualifications and narendra modi says i like to learn new things after my high school a senior in the sangh pushed me to finish my graduation which explains why he passed his graduation at the age of 28 because he was in the sunk right so i did my graduation as an external student from delhi university and also finished my post graduate as an external student i haven't seen the gates of a college so fairly so, so point is if this is a forgery as ashish ketan claims it is a forgery of seven Why papers would he die? listen listen it's a forgery of seven papers over two universities over five university sub departments over a period of 36 years of election affidavits right and also something which he has been saying consistently <laughs> in his interviews i am not show me one paper which does not match with the other and the second point the common sensical question was this if if it is a forgery then please tell me why would anybody forge the marks and say that they failed in certain years in certain subjects and did had to do supplementary exam if you are a perfect forger you say i got a first class first degree it a ring of genuineness that's what, what i was asking what a ring of genuineness <laughs> To no, make no, no, no! Some kind of argument that to you make it making. sound genuine. To You're, make the kind uh, of argument exactly that you are. What? Okay, Sabha, Sabha is responding. Oh, 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 Sabha is responding. 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 Sabha is No, I'm Ashish. Asking, I'm I, I, very Ashish. I have trouble buying this. That is of your no, debate. No, you're not allowing me to say anything. The debate are three. One, you, all these documents are genuine because they show that uh, Mr. Narendra Modi was a very. You know, close Ashish. Two, just these documents because are across seven seven departments, and three, they Narendra Modi claims to be a graduate even in an interview given in '96, right? These no, are no, the three no. surmises of your debate. That on the basis of three, this, these three surmises, I have come to the conclusion it. that all these three yeah, seven documents are genuine. Please stop for a while. Really, now Mr. Can I, Swami, will you allow others? You know, why can I? Yeah, yeah, can yeah, I yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, the reply, the reply from Sabha to produce no. the genuine records. Sabha, Ashish, Sabha. It's illogical. It's illogical. Let us presume. And put this debate to rest. Sabha, Mr. Khaitan, allow others to speak as well. Sabha, Sabha. You know, Ashish. There, there, it's, 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 there's something about this whole thing that is not making any sense. You are saying that they forged poor marks to make it convincing. You know, it's so complicated the whole thought behind all of this that they uh, come out with uh, bad marks to make the documents uh, appear to be real. Now I don't understand. Even if Mr. Modi is because, a high school dropout, because you had whether I personally failed. like his politics or not failed. is not the point. He's entitled to have even like that become the Prime Minister of India. you know so this is this is very complicated somehow my i'm not that, buying this exactly logic the that he about. is it is not uh, that they come out with bad mark sheets to make it we authentic i'll be very honest if Prime he's coming 10 plus 2 or just 10th pass no, even no, anna hazare we all love anna hazare nobody can deny the contribution that anna hazare has made to the to the politics of this country you to the anna hazare we all say you love anna hazare hello ashish yeah, anna ashish so let me understand this ashish ashish i i i deliberately forced bad anna hazare we would love upon a prime minister who places premium so, on property so, in public life it let is not about ashish now right listen yeah listen to the other side yeah come on you can't take over the debate one second 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 if we are if we are saying If we, saying, if we are saying, if we are saying, if we are saying that the name has been spelled wrong in one degree and one another degree, then you need to understand. Since you are talking about this country, we are a country where the election commission issues voter cards with a photograph of Salman Khan. For God's sake, is it a surprise that Delhi University makes a mistake in somebody's spelling? This is a country where people have received Aadhaar letters with photographs of trees, animals, or buildings in place of their own. Is it a surprise that in 1978 Delhi University made mistake? Hanuman ji received a summons recently. Hanuman ji received a summons from the court, and is it a surprise that in this, in this, in this, 
in okay. this country you have institutions which which mint mark sheets and mint degrees is it a surprise can I please, can that, okay okay I last last response from last response from sambit then we are going to the second debate one second and post degrees of delhi university okay okay is it a surprise something up and how i mean then go back to the politicians where are you heading please you mean to say that nobody is ever my god can i just degrees of delhi while mr goswami Mr. You mean Goswami, to say that the electorate is decided? Okay, as per the rules of the debate, I request a response. They don't lie consistently. This is a very simple matter. Very simple in the sense that way back 16 years ago, the time frame of all these examinations were discussed by the then uh, uh, Sangathan Mantri of Bharatiya Janata Party, the present Prime Minister, Mr. Narendra Modi. So he was not planning a coup 16 years before, and he did not know that one Arvind Kejriwal someday would come, and he will have to answer to his queries. Naturally. Absolutely. Secondly, I agree. I mean, look, the change of so goalpost a change of goalpost by the aam aadmi party you have to the five questions the four or five questions are please please be please you be also be know civil that. and please behave four or five questions sir, that were taken sir, up by asutos of the aam aadmi party you need in to be afternoon today you in fact to the aam aadmi party has been demolished on those counts so once they I'm have been caught on I'm those counts they are they are trying their best position. to shift the goal post but remember but I'm however I'm hard the aam aadmi party may try to shift the goal post from agastha westland the party the of agastha westland would also be caught and arvind kejriwal would also be exposed don't you worry we promise you that Okay, gentlemen, I can see the fireworks between the BJP and the AAP continue for some time. We've got, got a huge no, response. No, no, Six thousand no, plus tweets on this your debate. Madam would be caught. And, 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 and one second, and your madam would be caught. You know, okay, gentlemen. Sherni, Sherni. Amit Shah. And ladies and gentlemen, accompany me to Delhi. Ladies and gentlemen, let, um, let some. I thank you all. And Amisha and you accompany me to Delhi University tomorrow. I and thank you all. I thank you all, me. I thank you all for joining me. Sambit Patra and Inspector. I thank you all for joining me, Ashish Kedan, Sambit Patra, Sabha, and Sunil Alak for joining me on debate number one on the news hour tonight. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you.